Hey guys, it's Sydney and welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, as you can tell by the title, it's going to be my skincare routine, but like everything. So like day and night and like just all the products I use like in between. So we're covering all the bases today. So don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. I make new videos every Wednesday. Sometimes. Last week I didn't upload because I was too busy, but every Wednesday for the most part. So stick around. Follow me on Instagram for all kinds of updates and whatnot. I'm a lot more active on Instagram. So follow me on Instagram. Did I mention to follow me on Instagram? Just follow me on Instagram. But yeah, let's get into the video. So we are just gonna jump right into it. I have my basket of skincare items right next to me right here and we're just gonna cover it all. We're gonna just, yep, dive in. So to start things off with more of my morning routine. So in the morning, I don't really wash my face again and I know some people are gonna like cringe and like then the all high and mighty experts are gonna like comment below all passive aggressive, but you know, I don't care. This works for me. So in the morning, I don't wash my face because I washed my face the night before. So I just kind of splash my face with some water, you know, wake her up. And then I apply my moisturizer and this is the Simple Protecting Moisturizer. It has SPF 15 in it. I love this. I have probably gone through a few of these. Um, this moisturizer, it just doesn't like sit very heavy on my skin. It absorbs real quick. It has SPF in it, which is so important for like daily moisturizer, starting off your day with because you need SPF. You need SPF. Especially me living in Arizona, it doesn't matter if I know I'm gonna be in the sun all day. If I know I'm gonna be in the sun all day, then I'll do a stronger SPF, but just a daily one is awesome because you get the sun's rays from every angle, like walking to your car, in your car, you know? The sun's rays are always getting at you, so a moisturizer with SPF in it is crucial, in my opinion, for the beginning of the day. And that's really my daytime morning routine. I do wash my face though, if like I feel super gross or like I went out the night before and didn't take my makeup off, which is a huge no-no, but usually I'm like that good drunk where like she takes her makeup off. Maybe she doesn't wash her face, but like she takes her makeup off at least, which is like good enough for me. So sometimes little drunk Sid does that. But if she doesn't, then I do wash my face. And so I'll wash my face with the simple foaming cleanser or my Lush Herbalism. These two are my favorite, just kind of normal face washes. And so I'll get more in depth about that in a minute. Also a random thing I might do um, at the beginning of the day is if I know I'm like doing something special that day or my skin just looks a little tired, then I will do a quick um, glow oxygen mask. This is the Pixi one. Yeah, the Glow O2 um, oxygen mask and it's like a bubbly mask and so it's super fast to do. It just really wakes up your skin. You just put it on, it bubbles up and then you wash it off and this is really awesome. It just wakes your skin up a little bit more. gives it more of a glow as it implies and I, I really, 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 really love this. So this is awesome for those mornings when I do wake up and I'm kind of like She's not looking as good as she can be. You know what I'm saying? As for my nighttime skincare routine, that's when we really go off. We, we go off, okay? I initially wash my face with my Herbalism Face Wash by Lush. I love this stuff. I've been using it for a few years now. It's just amazing, and it has like a bit of like an exfoliant to it as well, but I just, I just really love the stuff. I've gone through like three, maybe more, definitely more containers of this. But if I want a deeper wash, then I will again use my foaming cleanser with, I have my basket sitting in my lap, so that's why I'm like Mary Poppins over here, with my Vanity Planet Spin for Perfect Skin Exfoliating Face Brush. It's one of those spin face brushes. I mentioned it in a video before and I have a link and everything for it so I'll put it down below. This this video isn't sponsored by them but this I use this all the time. So if I just need a little bit 
of a deeper exfoliation, then I use that foaming um, face wash from Simple because it works really well with the spin brush. And then it really just gets in there, exfoliates her. You know, sometimes I get dry patches, really cleans those out. So love this, love it. So then after I wash my face, I always use my Simple. This isn't sponsored by Simple. I just, their, their products really work with my skin because I have very sensitive skin, which also if you have sensitive skin, I would definitely try out Simple if you haven't already. So I use their Water Boost Skin Quench Sleeping Cream and it's just a very moisturizing um, night moisturizer. And it's awesome because it doesn't make me feel oily and like gross. It just really quenches my skin after I wash it because after I wash my skin I usually feel it tense up and feel a, like dry. And so this really just makes it all, makes it all better. But but sometimes this is like the whole video I'm gonna be like sometimes I do this sometimes I do that but I feel like that's skincare you know sometimes you gotta throw in a serum every now and then which speaking of so from time to time which time to time means um, a few times a week I'll use my Mario Badescu vitamin C serum and I will put this on after I wash my face so it'll be underneath this moisturizer um, and it's just a great serum. Vitamin C is so good for your skin. I'll just read what it says here. Help protect your skin from the damaging effects of free radicals with our antioxidant rich vitamin C serum. Absorbic acid helps to reduce visible signs of aging, brighten uneven skin tone, and smooth overall texture. Sodium, uh, that's a big word, helps preserve skin's natural moisture while collagen helps enhance firmness and elasticity so yeah I'll just you know squirt a little bit on of this on my face rub it all in down my neck as well you know because that collagen I don't want no wrinkles or a little saggy neck and I feel like it really does help um, reduce the texture on my skin as well like my skin of course I have makeup on but I just have BB cream and then like bronzer and blush and then like a teensy bit of highlight right now and like my skin is so amazing right now like knock on wood bitch. <laughs> and then another serum I will use bouncing in between the vitamin C one is this Glossier one it is their super bounce serum with hydrolic acid and vitamin B5 so this is another great little serum it says to ease skin and soften tight rough skin apply all over clean face and follow with a moisturizer so yeah, really love this stuff. This is one of, I think, three of Glossier's serums that they have. I want to try out their other two as well because I've just, I'm falling into the serum like dark hole where I'm just really loving serums. And then some nights I'll give my skin a break and I just won't use a serum. And another product that I use is this Burt's Bees Renewal Soothing Eye Cream. I just use this every now and then when I like literally remember to it's like almost empty but it's just an eye cream so after I moisturize I'll just put it just around my eyes you know just to help out the eyes <laughs> I don't really know all of like my nighttime kind of stuff products that I use you know it's not really a set routine it's just kind of like oh I'm gonna use my vitamin C serum tonight like oh I'm gonna use the Glossier one you know so it's not always a set routine the face wash and like moisturizing that's always a set routine always moisturize always get that moisturizer down your neck too future you will thank you yeah so those are just the products I use at night then jumping in to the random every now like even more every now and then category of skincare products so First things first is the Mario Badescu Drying Lotion. This stuff is amazing. So whenever I do get a breakout, like it's really annoying because since the sound, this is, I'm gonna sound so annoying, but since my face is already so clear, when I have one like zit, it's just like, you can't not look at it, you know? Like there's not other zits like distracting from it. My air conditioning just turned on. So when I do have like a zit, I just want to get rid of it ASAP. This stuff is amazing. It dries it out so like quick. It literally can get rid of it within like two nights. So you just 
stick a q-tip in it literally spot treatment like the zit it dries it out and then you wake up and like redness is down maybe the whole entire zit is down depending on how like big it was but I just love this stuff so one of my favorite face masks right now is this formula 1006 pores be pure um, skin clarifying mud mask with strawberry and yarrow so it says the skin refining mask with berry boosters goes straight to work on clogged pores strawberry and rosemary eliminate impurities while yarrow clarifies skin for instant complexion perfection so this is just a great mud mask. I'll do this every now and then when I notice my pores are looking a little bigger than I would like or clogged or just like, you know, just all the negative stuff you don't want. I will use this. I generally just kind of use it in my T-zone. That's where a lot of my pores are like, eh, and like kind of like right here is where my pores get big as well. And then also with pores, you gotta have your charcoal strips. I do these every now and then because especially my nose, it, the pores on my nose do get clogged very frequently which happens to a lot of people so this is great for really like yanking that shit out you know what I mean I think this is like my last thing but I have been obsessed with this overnight mask oh my gosh it is like I've never really seen a difference like a flat out like whoa difference with any kind of like mask or anything before like this one and I'm just like shook so you can get this at Target also which is amazing this is the bliss what a melon um, overnight mask it's a reviving and distressing mask it's like a jelly you put this on after you wash your face you let it dry and you go to sleep with it on without washing it off and then when you wake up your skin literally looks glowing my pores were noticeably like smaller and just looked less congested and then you like wash it off your face in the morning and you just feel like a goddess i use this a lot after like a weekend of going out like sunday night i'm like okay i need my skin to come back to me because i treated it so bad with tons of makeup and just like all that jazz you know so and this just wakes up my skin it's like hi who is she okay and then i almost forgot like my favorite thing ever that I use every single day is my Mario Badescu um, rose water spray it's yeah it's the pink one you know they have like four or three three different ones and then I also have the lavender one I haven't really used this one a ton but this would be my more like nighttime one this is my more daytime one I use this to set my makeup like I just used it today and I just spray it on my face whenever because you can literally just like Let's wake her up. Let's spray her. Love the Mario Badescu sprays. As you can tell, I really love Mario Badescu. If that's how you say the name, I don't know. Everyone really likes to correct me in the comments, even though I give the disclaimer that I don't know what I'm saying. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. Don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe. If you haven't already, I hate myself. Yeah, and I post new videos every Wednesday. And don't forget to follow me on Instagram. Did I mention to follow me on Instagram? Because follow me on Instagram. But yeah, I leave so many more updates and live stuff on there. So you could follow my life even more if it seems interesting to you. I don't know. But yeah, okay. I love you guys. Have a wonderful day. And I'll see you in my next video. Okay, bye guys.